Hey, hey, everybody, welcome back to another episode of Double E's Quickie Reviews for me and you. Still using the old Pix Pro, hopefully, it's working, or else I'm wasting a lot of video. Today, we're going to be reviewing something else I got on Amazon. It was really cheap and I needed it. It is something that's on the highway to the danger zone. Boom! The Gundam Infinity series Gundam Death Sigh. Now I was a fan of Gundam Wing. I wish they would release it better on DVD, but you know, Death Side was of course always my favorite. I like the Mark II Death Side more, but you know, I made all of these models, and well, right now they're down in the garage, but they're all broken and missing parts because I put them in a box, and after I moved, everything got destroyed and. Anyways, but when I did them, I, I painted around all the joints. Well, I used an X-Acto knife, and I pulled it around all the joints to give each plate a little bit more definition. See the other ones in the line? We have the Gundam Death Side, the Gundam, this one, and the Zaku 2. Apparently, you can mix and match the parts, which seems kind of stupid to me, but what the heck. Now what I'd love to get is a Gundam Burning Hands. That was a cool Gundam. But, you know, ain't gonna happen. Let's get this bad boy open. Models are just too damn expensive. I can figure out how to get this thing open. Come on. They got way Where's my opener? Way, way too much plastic on these things. There we go. Okay, most of it did not survive the process of opening, but that's okay. Uh, lots of little breaky parts booster on the back. Let's try to pop them back together. I can figure out which arm goes where. Okay, that arm goes over here. Yeah. Dang it. Well, I'm doing this. Uh, you any of you guys know the Gundam Death Size pilot's name? Put your answer down in the... <coughs> Excuse me. Down in the uh, comments below. Okay, then what the heck? Oh, jumping Jehovah! What is going on here? This does not want to pop together too easy. I don't know if this is a symptomatic of this line, or if it's this figure, or I'm doing something wrong. Is there like a button I'm supposed to push? I don't think so. I think it's supposed to just pop on. Yeah. There's that. Then I suppose this top part is just supposed to... There we go. Okay. Popped into place. Good, good, good. Now, I've always found it funny that the Gundams always had big feet. The accessories are... Oh, it doesn't even open. It's supposed to open up. Yeah. Well, there's the shield. I'm thinking for even the few dollars I spent on this might have been too much. There we go. Then the sigh. The blade is freaking huge on this thing. Now, all in all, I would say that he's about maybe four, maybe five inches tall. The detailing. Oh, I mean, I'm getting a leg cramp. The detail isn't very detailed. He turns all right. Everything moves all right, and he's going to look good static on the shelf. But as a toy, no, I don't. Well, I wouldn't recommend this as a toy. Got this booster on the back. That thing's supposed to pop out. Is yeah, the plastic like really, really flimsy too. All in all, it's going to look good on the shelf, but it is not going to. Yeah. Boom. Yep. 
he's really not going to be good as an actual toy. So if you got kids who want to play with Gundams, I don't recommend this. Because the parts just seem to want to fall apart. If you're like me when I was younger, you beat the crap out of your toys. Oh man, I better zoom back out. There we go. Anyways, do I have that on backwards? No, that's supposed to be in the Okay, yep. Yeah. It's confusing. I wish I had better instructions and they weren't in Japanese, but hey. It's an import, I think. And it's it's Death Side. Everybody loves Death Side. As I said, I prefer the second version with the wings that fold out and in. But you get what you can get. And hey, hey, how about how about releasing the TV series again? Gundam Wing? Or even the movie Endless Waltz? So some of us can get it on DVD without costing a freaking arm and a leg. Region 1? Huh? Come on. Stop being selfish with your Gundams. An entire set. I mean, not just the original Gundams either. I mean... Gundam Wing, Gundam, uh, what's that one where they're all fighting each other? That one, one of Burning Hands, one of the great Gundams. Uh, Unicorn, not so much. But, you know, I've seen the originals, they were okay. But the, the individual Gundams, with their look cool. Not just military robots, but actually... But cool. Or heck, even more Gundam from Gundam Wing. Some of the the Taugis, the you know, all the other ones. Sandrock. Heavy arms. I've seen heavy arms, but again, really pricey. Uh I can't even remember them all now that I'm trying to Gundam Zero. All these cool ones. Or how about some of the pilots? I would love to get the pilots. They're too damn expensive online. Anyways, thank you for watching. I have really nothing else to say. Trying to keep this video short. Listen to Death Sigh. Y'all have a nice night. And remember, mission accepted. Have a nice night. Double D, out.